Meeting Module Unit 5, Production Tape 1. On the comprehension tape in this unit, you learn questions and answers used in leaving a message and in changing the date of a meeting. If you think that you might have forgotten the meaning of some of these sentences, go back to the end of the C1 tape and review them. If you think that you know the meanings of all the sentences on the target list, you should begin learning how to say them. The situations on this tape are set in the PRC. As the conversation opens, the phone is ringing at the switchboard of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Listen. Why? Why? Is it a ministry? I want to Repeat, Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Why? Why? Repeat, hello, is this the Ministry of Foreign Affairs? Why? Is it a ministry? Why? Is it a ministry? Repeat the title, Department Chief. Repeat, I want to speak to Department Chief Lin. I want to speak to Department Chief Lin. Notice that when you want to speak with someone on the phone, you may use the verb Zhao to look for. In English, you would probably say, I'd like to speak with or to Department Chief Lin. But in Chinese, you say, I want to look for Department Chief Lin to talk. Repeat again, I want to speak with Department Chief Lin. I want to speak with Department Chief Lin. Say it ahead of the speaker. I want to speak to Department Chief Lin. The telephone conversation continues. You are from where? I am from Le Clair. I am a foreign minister. In a business call, when you want to ask who is this, you ask you are where, but using the verb sure, not zai as you would in a real location question. The verb sure, as you remember, identifies the subject. You might interpret this question as you are of what place? Now you answer the phone and ask who this is. You'll get a reply. You are from where? I am Le Clair. Again. You are from where? I am Le Clair. I am from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Now take a look at the reply. Repeat. My name is Le Clair. I am from Le Clair. I am from Le Clair. Now repeat the name of France used in the PRC. France. France. Notice that it's said with a low tone. In other places, you may hear it with a falling tone. Now repeat the word for commercial business. 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 Repeat economic officer. Economic officer. Economic officer. Repeat. I'm the commercial economic officer from the French embassy. I'm the commercial economic officer from the French embassy. And repeat again. My name is Leclerc. I'm Leclerc. I'm Le Clair. Repeat again. I'm the commercial economic officer from the French embassy. I'm the French embassy official. I'm the French embassy official. Try responding to the question yourself now. Say that your name is Leclerc and that you're the commercial economic officer from the French embassy. You are
，我姓勒克莱尔，我是法国大使馆的商务经济官。Again， 您是哪儿啊？我姓勒克莱尔，我是法国大使馆的商务经济官。The operator replies, "Listen." 你等一等，我给你看看他在不在。Repeat, "Wait a moment, I'll see if he's here or not." 您等一等，我给您看看他在不在。您等一等，我给您看看他在不在。Notice that when 在 is used without a place word following it, it means to be present. How do you say, "Wait a moment, I'll see if he's here or not"? 您等一等，我给您看看他在不在。The conversation continues. Listen. Why? 他这会儿不在，您要留个话吗？劳驾他回来的时候，您请他给我打个电话。Repeat, ask him to give me a phone call. 请他给我打个电话。请他给我打个电话。Repeat, when he comes back, please ask him to give me a phone call. 劳驾他回来的时候，您请他给我打个电话。劳驾他回来的时候，您请他给我打个电话。Try responding to the question yourself now. Instead of leaving a message, ask to have him call you back when he returns. Why? 他这会儿不在。你要留个话吗 ？Again. Why? 他这会儿不在，你要留个话吗？劳驾他回来的时候，您请他给我打个电话。The operator replies, "Listen." 好，请您把您的电话号码告诉我，我写下来。我的电话是五二幺三三幺。Repeat the verb which means to write down. 写下来，写下来。You've seen many verbs with directional endings before. For example, naturally to take out. But notice that here in the verb 写下来 the directional ending 下来 takes on an abstract meaning. It does not literally mean to write in a direction going down, but rather to write something on paper. This use of directional endings in both their literal and abstract meanings is surprisingly similar to the English use of prepositions after verbs. For instance, we say walk out or jump down. Where you really do go out or down, as well as close down or wear out, where nothing is really going down or out. Repeat. I'll write it down. 我写下来。我写下来。Now repeat the word for number in the sense of identification number. 号码儿。号码儿。Repeat telephone number. 电话号码儿。电话号码儿。Now repeat the marker of objects. 把，把。Although the marker 把 cannot be translated into English as a preposition, 把 does function in Chinese like the words we have called prepositional verbs. As a prepositional verb, it's followed by an object. Which in turn is followed by the main verb. Repeat. Please tell me your phone number. 请您把您的电话号码告诉我
请您把您的电话号码告诉我。To help you understand how ba fits into the sentence, you might want to try translating it as take. For instance, repeat he put the suitcases in front, or more literally, he took the suitcases and put them in the front. 他把行李放在前边。他把行李放在前边。Translating sentences with ba as take the object and do something with it can remind you of two things. One is that the verb must be an action verb. The other is that the action must do something to the object. The action affects the object in some way. The action in ba sentences has often been described as disposing of the object. That is, you take the object and do something with it or to it. Now repeat. He sold the car, or he took the car and sold it. 他把汽车卖了。他把汽车卖了。You might think it's very obvious to say that the action of the verb must do something to the object, but consider the sentence: He believed my story. You really couldn't ask, "What did he do with my story?" and answer, "He believed it." The action of the verb doesn't affect the object. But you could ask, "What did he do with the car?" and answer, "He sold it." Only this last example can be said using ba. How do you say he sold the car? He sold the car. There are, of course, many different ways you can affect the object. You can physically move it. You can have it change ownership. Here's another example. Repeat, "Put the book on the table." 把书放在桌子上。把书放在桌子上。In addition to the fact that the object must be disposed of or somehow affected by the action of the verb, the object must also be specific, that is, refer to a known thing. The object in a sentence like "Tell me a story" could not be put before the verb using ba, but the object in the sentence like I gave the book to older sister. Can be. How do you say I gave the book to older sister? Now repeat. Please tell me your phone number. Here, the verb is also more than one syllable, and it's followed by the indirect object "wa." How do you say? Please give me your phone number. And how do you say? I'll write it down. 我写下来 Try saying these sentences yourself again. This time you'll get a reply. Say, "Please tell me your phone number. I'll write it down." 请你把你的电话号码告诉我。我写下来。好，我的电话是五二幺三三幺。Again。请你把你的电话号码告诉我，我写下来。好，我的电话是五二幺三三幺。Notice that the phone number is given with the syllable "yao" for the number one. This pronunciation for the number one is very common in Peking. Repeat the telephone number five two one three three one. Five two one three three one. Five two one three three one. Repeat. My phone number is five two one three three one. My phone number is five two one three three one. 五二幺三三幺，
我的电话是五二幺三三幺。Respond to the request yourself now. Give your telephone number. Say that it's five two one three three one. 请您把您的电话号码告诉我，我写下来。好，我的电话是五二幺三三幺。Again， 请您把您的电话号码告诉我，我写下来。好，我的电话是五二幺三三幺。Later that day, the p a r t m e n t chief Lin. Calls Miss Leclaire back. Listen. 对不起，你刚才给我打电话，我不在。你有事吗？是啊。Repeat the word for just now or a short while ago. 刚才，刚才。Repeat. When you called me just now, I wasn't in. 您刚才给我打电话，我不在。您刚才给我打电话，我不在。As a two-syllable adverb, 刚才 may go before or after the subject. Repeat the following variation of "When you called me just now, I wasn't in." 刚才您给我打电话，我不在。刚才您给我打电话，我不在。Notice that even though you're talking about a past event, the negative adverb 不 is used. This is because the verb 在 is a state verb. The negative marker used with a state verb is 不 in the past, present, or future. Repeat, I'm sorry. When you called just now, I wasn't in. 对不起，您刚才给我打电话，我不在。对不起。刚才您给我打电话，我不在。Say it ahead of the speaker. I'm sorry. When you called just now, I wasn't in. Miss Leclaire tells why she called. Listen. 我那天跟您约好了。明天十点到您办公室去谈谈。Repeat the other day. 那天，那天。Repeat. Successfully agreed on a time. 约好了，约好了。Repeat. The other day I made an appointment with you. 我那天跟您约好了。我那天跟您约好了。Repeat office. 办公室。办公室。Repeat tomorrow at ten. I'll go to your office for a talk. 明天十点到您办公室去谈谈。明天十点到您办公室去谈谈。Repeat. The other day, I made an appointment with you to go to your office at ten tomorrow for a talk. 我那天跟您约好了，明天十点到您办公室去谈谈。我那天跟您约好了，明天十点到您办公室去谈谈。Try saying it ahead of the speaker. I 那天跟您约好了，明天十点到您办公室去谈谈。What's the word for office? 办公室。How do you say the other day? 
那天。How do you say successfully agreed upon? 约好了。Miss Leclaire continues. 因为我明天早上有一件要紧的事，所以想问您能不能改到下午。Repeat the word for urgent or important. 要紧，要紧。Repeat a piece of important business. 一件要紧的事，一件要紧的事。Repeat the word for therefore. 所以，所以。Repeat the verb to change or alter. 改，改。Repeat. I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. 想问您，我们能不能改到下午？ Repeat. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the
I'm sorry, when you called just now, I wasn't in. Can I help you with something? Yes, the other day I made an appointment with you to go to your office at 10 o'clock tomorrow for a talk. Because I have an urgent piece of business tomorrow morning, I want to ask you whether we can change it to the afternoon. Fine. Would tomorrow afternoon at three be all right? Yes. See you tomorrow. This is the end of the tape. End of meeting module unit five, production tape one. Module Unit 5, Production Tape 1. Module Unit 5, Production Tape 1. Module Unit 5, Production